when the display board of indoor unit displays E3 or F5. That indicates the malfunction of fan motor speed being out of control. Malfunction decision conditions. When indoor fan speed keeps too low, 300 RPM, for certain time, the unit will stop and the LED will display the failure. The failure may be caused by 1. Wiring error 2. Faulty fan 3. Faulty fan motor 4. Faulty man PCB board Shut the power off, then turn it on two minutes later. If the error still exists, shut the power off, then check the fan. Rotate the fan by hand. Check whether the fan is blocked or rotating normally and whether the screws which fix the fan have been tightened enough. If the fan is normal, check the wiring of the fan motor according to the wiring diagram. Commonly, there are three kinds of DC fan motors with different pins. First, DC motor with a five cores pin, which has a control chip inside itself. Second, DC motor with two pins, three cores pin and five cores pin. The control chip for it is on the main PCB board. Separately, 3 cores pin connects to the power supply. 5 cores pins is used for signal transmission. The third, DC motor with a 3 cores pin, which has the control chip in itself. Examination for the indoor fan motor. Taking AC motor with feedback as an example. It has two pins. Separately, 3 cores pin connects to the power supply. 5 cores pin is used for signal transmission. If the connection is correct, check the fan motor. Examination for main PCB board. DC motor with feedback and its control chip is on the board. Turn the power on. When the unit is in standby mode, measure the voltage of pin 4 to 5 in feedback signal connector. Examination for main PCB board, DC motor with control chip in itself. Turn the power on. When the unit is in standby mode, measure the voltage between pin 1 to pin 3, pin 4 to pin 3, in fan motor connector. If the value of the voltage is not within the range shown in the table. Examination for main PCB board, AC motor with feedback. Turn the power on and set the unit as running in high-speed mode. 15 seconds later, measure the voltage of pin 1 to pin 2 in fan motor connector. If the value of the voltage is lower than 100 volts, 208 to 240 volts power supply, or 50 volts, 115 volts power supply, the PCB must have problems and needs to be replaced. If the value of the voltage is normal, the fan motor needs to be replaced. If the error still exists, replace the main PCB.